What's good? Y'all know who it is, y'all know what it is. Your boy Matthew Shack live here in Los Angeles. Welcome to Matthew Shack Unfiltered. Niner Empire, or as somebody here on YouTube told me to call you guys, 49er Faithful, Trey Lance. <laughs> Trey Lance. First thing, let me get to this, this first. What do you guys want to call yourselves, man? Because 49er Faithful is what my dad's people call them. Now, you know, that's the old terminology, you know? All the young cats that I know, they want to be called Niner Empire. So you guys let me know down here what you guys prefer, man. But, hey, man, I had somebody tell me, uh, not Niner Empire, we're 49er faithful. I'm like, uh, all right. <laughs> sorry, so, sorry if I said it wrong, man. I'm just, you know, cats that I know, they, they, they go by uh, Niner Empire. But anyway, Trey Lance up in this piece, man. Trey Lance. Hey. Jimmy Garoppolo era is over, dog. Now, dog, because Trey Lance went out there, and let's let's comp compartmentalize this, you guys, man. I know you guys. I know I, all y'all Niner people, man. I know you guys, man. Trust me, I related to y'all, friends, y'all work with y'all, uh, all that. Let's understand this preseason game. But with that being said, dog, that seventy-six yard touchdown pass that Trey Lance threw in. Uh, we're on the 39, I was watching. I watched. I wanted to make sure that I saw, okay, what this kid can do. That 76-yard pass that he threw, uh, I think his guy received his name Danny Green or whatever. The most impressive part about that was not the fact that it was a 76-yarder, okay? The part that impressed me the most was that was a 44-yard pass on a rope. Trey Lance only threw it 44 yards. The receiver ran an extra 30 something, but but he threw it so perfectly. He threw it just a dime in a situation where it was a 39, man. And he played well, man. Four for five passing. He had one seven yard run, 76 yard tub. Pass a rating of 158.9. Yeah, perfect, you know, damn near perfect pass a rating. Damn near. Uh, and he looked good, man. And he didn't have none of his weapons out there. There was no Kittle out there. There was no Debo out there. He 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 looked good, man. He looked good. Y'all, y'all definitely, man, aren't gonna have no excuses, man. It's going to be like this, Niner Empire or Niner 49 or Faithful or whatever y'all want to be, you know. You better understand right now, man, that performance right there shows his shows his ability. So if he's going to have some rookie situations or if he, if he has a bad game or, or things don't go well, I don't want to hear nothing, dog. I don't want to hear nothing because I already know, man, when things are good, everybody wants to talk about it. When things are bad, everybody wants to talk about, well, young, well, uh, second year, well, first time starter, well, hey, man, I've been seeing the greats start in a rookie season. I've seen, seen uh, Peyton Manning lead, lead the league in interceptions. I've seen Troy Aikman uh, win two games his first year. I, I've seen all these cats in, in, in get thrown out to the to the wolves man no excuses bro you're a professional football player you're a starter on one of the 32 nfl teams it is what it is dog but trey lance plays like he played yesterday the nfc west is gonna have some serious nightmares with that kid man the kid can run the kid got a gun the kid is accurate as hell man the kid Looks like he has swagged up. I was like, here we go. We're going to see, man. It's going to be good, man. It's going to be good, man. But uh, y'all got to figure out what y'all going to do with that big-ass, bloated-ass uh, Jimmy Garoppolo contract, man. Y'all need to y'all need to trade him for a can of paint and and, and, and some uh, paint brushes that only have a couple of uh, paint bristles on it. He, he, you got to get rid of that big-ass contract, dog. You got to get rid of it, man. Uh, and then the other second string quarterback, third string quarterbacks, they look cool. They look decent, you know. Uh, but it's Trey Lance show, man. It's going to be on him, dog. 
you're going to go how he goes. I expect the defense for the Niners to be uh, formidable as usual. I expect the receiving core to do what they got to do. I expect Debo to be Debo. I expect George Kittle to hopefully not be George Brittle and play. Uh, but if Trey Lance plays like that, man, there's going to be some problems. There's going to be some big problems. All right, man, love all y'all out there, man. Matthew Shaq on Filter.